surface of course it's a scratch canvas frame so it's got that sort of drum effect if you hit it like that it sounds like a drum but if, uh, if you want to do it you can paint around the edges to the man who goes sliding across go backwards and forwards a little bit as I said tilt it up you can see there's not enough to come off but I'll I'll persevere now if you wanted to thicken this up you can use a brush now and you can thicken parts up because you've got the confidence that it's it's correct you can use some tiny things like this also uh, I forgot about the uh, another thing up here the uh, I'm going to dip the fan brush into directly into paint and the wind's whipping across this way even though the lights come this way for dramatic effect I'm going to just gently tap a little bit like that and let, let the, the shape, see I've got it tilted at a slight angle and like the wind is picking up the top of the foam and blowing it off like, like the top of a, um, a glass of beer, We're cutting it across. Of course we can't, you've got to be careful to be not repetitious so you don't want all these perfect lines of the same shape so I've got to be careful I fall into this trap all the time I can say to other people be careful because it's easy it's easy to bring that into the hole there I can't help myself I just want to darken the bottom of that glass strip I'm going to take a little bit of Payne's grey 